Hi, I'm Steve. And I'm Joyce, and we run a five-star boutique hotel uh, near a tiny little village. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> we don't even know where we run it. <laughs> yeah. Hi, I'm Steve. And I'm Joyce. And together, and together we, we are Blackwell Black House. House. I come from five miles from where Blackwell House is and I am a farmer's daughter. My father had 13 children and so I was very used to seeing huge family gatherings and there's a great love of food in my family. My grandmother Lily was a fantastic cook, uh, my great aunt Maggie and of course my mum. And my mother used to say I used to pull up a stool, stand beside her and bake and do you know what i can't ever remember a uh, not knowing the recipe for cakes scones etc because i've just cooked them all my life so i've spent my life in the corporate environment which is a very different environment to blackmore house i would have traveled extensively across uh, europe and the uk and, and also across the world um, and i've had the opportunity to have dined in um, some of the finest restaurants around the world but more importantly for me, I, I've had the uh, opportunity to work with some of the top uh, chefs uh, across the UK uh, and uh, across parts of Europe um, and had the opportunity to um, see behind the scenes of how these places operate and work. Joyce will do the cooking um, and I would do the front of house um, and it's, uh, it's such a delight when you um, take out a very good plate of food to, uh, to our guests. Um, and then when you return, that plate is empty. Uh, when I welcome a guest through the door, and I do like to welcome the guest myself, that they feel that they're a friend coming to visit me in my home. I think that's what makes us different. It simply is very much like coming to a country house for a weekend. So there's old, there's old sayings that, uh, you know, you, you, you uh, meet as strangers and you part as friends. And, yeah. Um, and, but I think that's exactly what happens here. You know, we, we, we meet people for the first time at the door, as Joyce says, we greet them at the door. Um, but when they leave, um, it is really as friends. There are hugs, uh, there are um, fond farewells, and hopefully um, we see them again soon uh, as actually, friends. We, we see often some do. people many times. <laughs> yes, yeah. absolutely we do. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is what you get here, is you're not just a number. You are taken care of, yeah, yeah. I think also that's reflected in our rooms because although we wanted our rooms to be very luxurious, like a hotel room, a really good hotel room, but we wanted to add all the extras that are often missing from a hotel, mm. um, things that we would have loved to have had in hotels, especially when you're working. Um, so we add all the little touches like a variety of books, um, we certainly make sure that you've got homemade shortbread, literally mm. made fresh that morning. Yeah. And oh, that you've got freshly ground coffee and a coffee pot if you want to make proper coffee in the morning. They like to feel those creature comforts. They like to feel um, that this is a place they can just kick off their shoes and, and just mm -hmm. completely relax, walk around the gardens if they wish. Do you know what guests love? Middle of winter, horrible winter's night, yeah. They get into the bed, a lovely warm hot water bottle. But there's also the guest that wants to come here for the peace, the tranquility and the seclusion. Mm -hmm. You know, we're in the middle of the, the beautiful Armagh countryside. Um, there is no trains, there are no planes, there's no traffic noise, there are no street lights. It is just peace and quiet mm -hmm. here. And guests will often come here. Uh, they may come for two or three mm -hmm. days and some don't even leave the house. No. They just sit in the garden room, They're actually read a amazed book, at, and enjoy yeah. that peace and They're quiet. amazed at how quiet it is. Mm, yeah. And often in the morning, when I ask guests, have you had a good night's sleep? They're just amazed yeah. at how quiet it is, and yeah. also how dark it is. Yes. Um, yeah. And you know, you really get to see the stars. Because it is pitch black, there's absolutely no yeah. street lighting here at all. Yeah. So people normally have a very sound night's sleep.